Before the video starts, I just want to say that I stream almost every single day, so if you do enjoy these videos, come check me out at live at twitch.tv forward slash Omichi Salad and come say hi. Link's going to be in the description. What's up guys, I'm Omichi Salad and welcome to my first New World build for uh, the closed beta. This is going to be, uh, it's kind of hard to give it a name, it's a two, uh, double uh, heavy weapons build. It's going to be the Great Axe and the Warhammer builds going full strength and maybe some constitution. I don't want to go too into the to the skills. I'll put the link in the description for the build because uh, it'll take too long to explain everything. But I'll I'll just do a brief uh, a brief summary of it, and then I'll show you uh, some PVP gameplay that I got with my friends uh, when we were taking a fort and went full strength by level sixty. Uh, a, a build, uh, for your for your specializations, you want to go either if you don't want to go full strength, you want to be a little tanky. Maybe go 50-50, strength constitution. Or you can just go full strength and the gear sets you pick up uh, go straight constitution. So it's really up to you. Uh, so for the gear set itself, um, I'm personally going... Uh, I don't have a choice because my RNG has been shit. But uh, the, the all the items I've picked up have been light light armor. And I haven't had any trouble PvP. I, I've gone against uh, uh, people my, my level around like 20-ish. And uh, being light, you are a little bit squishy. You, you, you should be a little bit careful on um, going against people. Like the spear, the spear hurts. There's a so basically it's up to you. You, you, can, you can mix and match your gear, but the w with going fully light, you get that 20% damage uh, bonus. And you're also, um, the, the movement speed is also a lot better. And that's going to really, me honestly, medium and light build is probably one of the best to go with. Uh, the great axe build that I'm about to show you because of the uh, movement speed you can go heavy You're still fast as heavy with with the uh, w with the ability that the great axe gives you But yeah, it's really up to you. So what I went for is kind of like uh, 75 25 on the skill sets So I got I fully upgraded Mahler and then I fully upgraded reap and then execute so these three skills are gonna be really they're really good for PvE and also honestly really good for PvP. Uh, the the Maelstrom is just a really good AOE uh, that does like a good amount of damage against uh, players and um, uh, AI. Also, Reap is a good pull thing. Not really good for PvE. Maybe if you're one v oneing a a boss or something, I guess it's all right. It has a heal which which helps a little bit, but honestly, it's just for maybe you can switch it out for either Whirlwind, Gravity Well when you're going PvE, but for PvP, to pull people in, it's really good. Sometimes, it's a little bit inconsistent. I've pulled someone in, and I guess it's at the same time where they dodge, so it pulls them in a little bit, but then, like, shoots them off. It's a little bit buggy. And then, basically, the one thing you're going to work on, uh, once you get into the game, you want to level up your uh, Great Axe as fast as possible. You want Bloodlust. So, because you get that 30% bonus movement speed and 15% damage just by looking at someone, you're gonna be able to catch up to people real quick. It's really nasty. So, so uh, link will be in the description. Uh, I'm not gonna go on the the passives. It's up to you if you want to go crit or armor pen, etc. Uh, we're gonna go into the Warhammer. So you basically want to fully upgrade Crowd Crusher. You, there's basically may, maybe one one passive that I'm not taking on Crowd Crusher, but you want to go Shockwave, Clear Out, Path of Destiny. These abilities are disgusting. I think they used to be incredibly powerful in the closed alpha. I think it got nerfed a little bit, but Shockwave, AoE stun for a few seconds, for two seconds, that's pretty good. It lets you rev up a heavy attack with the Warhammer, and a Warhammer heavy attack, if you're going full strength, hurts like shit. Uh, clear out is good, um, honestly, if, if you're getting, it's good in wars, if you're getting 1v4 and they're all up on you, it, it's good to knock enemies back. And it's also good to, to stop enemies in their track because you can you hit them. You can also hit them towards your friends to, to help them out. And then also uh, j just to knock them over. It's just really good. And then Path of Destiny is a nice AoE, uh, like like a shockwave that, that goes like in a direction. It doesn't go too far, but it's still good to maybe catch up to people. Or it's a, it's a very good starting ability to use when you're about to like getting in a group fight or something. Be because because of its AOE and like the damages it does, and then the final uh, the what is it called the ultimate I guess ability the aftershock, uh, any 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 ability any uh, AOE ability slows everyone by twenty percent. So every single one of these abilities they are going to be slowed for four seconds. 
So that's incredibly good if you're chasing after people or starting on someone and they're going to be like, what the fuck hit me? I got to run. And they can't run because they're 20% slowed. So it's very good. It's basically, you want to start off with a Warhammer and then you want to move on to the Great Axe as the finisher. So these two abilities are really good. Uh, link will be in the description. I don't want to go in. I don't know how many people there's in here. I got one. Oh, one, two. I got two up here. Three. Okay, okay, here we go. Ow! Oh, we got a ton of green stuff. There we go. Yeah, he's shooting the shit out of me. Woo! Shredding us, bro. Yeah. How did he dodge that? That that's not how. That's not that's not that's bullshit, bro. I I I'm hitting him with those abilities. Everyone's just standing in the way. We got him now. Dude, this guy's good. Oh my god. He's not. He's just dodging our fucking shots. It doesn't matter. He's dead. You're fine, you're fine. I'm fucking one shot. Did you die? Don't die, don't die, don't die. Chris, you can still win this. I got you, I got you. Oh my god, brother. Watch out, watch out, watch out. <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm one shot, I'm one shot. She's low, she's low. I got him? Nice, nice, nice. Dead. Hit the other? Oh shoot, I'm low. Dodge, 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 dodge. I'm going. I'm going after. Oh no, I'm down, I'm down. What killed you? He, he, there's another one somewhere. I'm coming. I, my spawn's really close. I'm coming. I got sniped. I'm coming. There he is, they got me fucked up here! One's on the wall, I see right above like the door. I'm, I'm here, I'm here. He's super low, if you can hit him. One more shot, hit him, hit him! Yes, nice! <laughs> good shit, good shit! Finishing! He's super low. I got him. Nah. Claim the control point. What's up? Claim the control point. How do we? Yeah, did this? They came from that. Door. How do we, how do we claim it? Oh, you can do something at it. Like, get to destroy it. What is it? 
I got no idea. There's, I see a little red circle I can interact with it. Oh, wait, it's green now. It's green now. We're good. No, it's going up slowly. It's going up slowly.